Mariners visiting the White Sox, a chilly night in Chicago, but the heat on Jose Quintana in the top of the fifth, already down 2-1 with two men on. Franklin Gutierrez down the left field line. Two runs come in to score as the Mariners go in front 4-1 on the two RBI double. Very next batter is Michael Saunders. He goes down the right field line. Gutierrez scores easily. It's a triple for Saunders and a 5-1 Seattle lead. They'd score one more in the inning to take a 6-1 lead. Bottom of the inning now, 6-2 Mariners. Blake Bevin on the mound facing Alejandro Deaza with a man on. And Deaza, a two-run shot to right field, makes it a 6-4 ball game. Deaza's first of the year. Two batters later, Alex Rios up with the bases empty. And he goes deep. White Sox back into the ball game. Bevin went five. He's not happy. He gave up five earned runs on six hits. Now to the seventh, Stephen Pryor on the mound facing Alex Rios. With runners on second and third, he gets the ground out to shortstop, but Gordon Beckham comes in to score. It's a tie ball game. Now all the way to the 10th inning, Nate Jones pitching, facing Hendrys Morales with a go-ahead run on second. That is go. fair ball down the line. Morales gets it done. Goody's going to score. Morales will ease into second. With an RBI double, and the Mariners are back on top 7-6, top of the 10th here in Chicago. Two batters later, Jesus Montero up with a man on second. He singles in a center field. That would score Robert Andino. And you never know when you need some insurance as Seattle takes an 8-6 lead into the bottom of the 10th. Tom Wilhelmson trying to shut the door. Runners at the corners, though, facing Dwayne Wise. And Wise grounds one through for a base hit. In comes Rios. It's a one-run ball game. Wilhelmson then walked Alexei Ramirez to load the bases, and then facing Tyler Flowers, tried to shut the door. The 0-2 to Flowers. Struck him out, that's the ball game. Closing time, finally. <laughs> Mariners win it, 8-7. Mariners win a wild one. Gutierrez finished three for five with three RBIs. He scored three times. Paul Konerko had a fourth inning single. He passed Frank Thomas for third place on the White Sox franchise hit leaders list.